The weirdest scientific fact that I know is that the human body is actually mostly made of non-human cells. So we're only about 43% human cells. We're really made up of mostly prokaryotic cells, which are these bacterial cells and all these things that are helpful for us. But since they're smaller than human cells, you know, it's like about 10 cells, 10 bacterial cells for every one of your regular cells. So when you add it all together, <laughs> you're really mostly non-human, which is crazy. <laughs> My name is Samuel Washington Jr. I'm a teacher, a science educator at Woodlands High School in Greenberg, New York. I've taught actually several sciences over the course of my year. Most of them are the biological sciences. So everything from life science to biology to in New York State, we have the living environment regions to the biology honors. So being a black male educator, I, I am in a minority in this field. Over 70% of educators are actually uh, white or white women. Um, and so 2% are, are, are people of color. So I, I find myself in areas where I'm the minority most places I go. I don't see me a lot. And that's one of the things that drives me because I feel that I'm needed. <laughs> I'm needed there. I'm needed there for my people, for my youth. Um, but for all youth. So even when I'm, when I'm teaching classroom, it's not just Black History Month, it's Hispanic Heritage Month, it's Women's History Month. You know, I, I cover the whole gamut because I, I, I tell people that you, know, you have an identity and you should be proud of that. So I've always had a love of bowling. I started bowling as a youngster because my dad was a bowler. So here at Woodlands, I started a bowling club um, in the 456 school to kind of prepare students to get to the high school. So once those students got to the high school level, we had huge success here. We were league champions for nine years in a row. I think I have a, a natural flow with children. I actually do make a difference. That's my reward. Um, in any aspect of my life, I always find myself trying to give back. And uh, that's part of my DNA, you know, no pun intended. <laughs>